well, every infield starts at shortstop. That's the, the way the game was designed way back when. And uh, I think we have as good a shortstop as there is in the country. And Donovan Walton, he wins. He plays great defense. He, uh, he's a clutch hitter. He has quality at bats. He can do everything from laying down a sack bunt to hitting a home run to uh, executing a hit and run to drawing a walk to a two strike base hit. He's just one heck of a player and uh, he's an even better kid. And I say that, that's a, that's a true compliment because he is a great player. But he's a wonderful kid. He's got great work, work ethic. Uh, he's a very inclusive kid to all his teammates. He's just a real bright spot on our team every single day. Uh, first base, Dustin Williams returns. Had a very good sophomore year. He's improved. Uh, from a year ago, he's stronger, and, and I think he'll continue to, to build on what's been a, a pretty good two-year uh, output to this point. And then we have some new faces, uh, both at second base and third base. Jacob Chapel returns, who was our uh, everyday infielder a year ago, both at short and third in Donnie's absence, and then Jacob's competing for time both at second and third. Uh, we saw he did good things as a freshman. Garrett Benge is a newcomer at third base and had a really good fall and uh, offensively brings a lot to our lineup. So he's a guy at third base right now that's, that's done a really good job to this point. And then some guys in Andrew Rosa, who comes back from an arm injury a year ago, uh, working hard to get back on the field. J.R. Davis, a uh, first year kid coming out of Seminole Junior College, uh, has a bat loaded with some energy in it and a very good athlete. And David Petrino, a kid who <coughs> was with us last year, uh, was a role player. And uh, he's a guy that, that is looking to make a bigger impact in his second year. So you look across the, the second, short, third spots, those kids have a chance to fill in there. Mason O'Brien returns at first base uh, as a guy that's more healthy now than he was a year ago with some pop in his bat. And uh, Nick Gallo kind of rounds out our, our infield picture as a guy that can play all three infield positions and uh, is extremely sure-handed. So we've got some good options there. There's a lot of competition. Kids continue to work. and and uh, look to get better every single day. By no means are a couple of those spots locked in stone, but I think when you look at shortstop, uh, we've got our guy there in Donovan. Uh, Dustin Williams is a guy that's played a lot of really good baseball at first base, uh, and Garrett Bench had a really standout fall at third. So a lot of these other guys are getting looks at second base, and we're moving them around so that we know uh, kind of where our depth lies and what we would do in case of injury. Um, so it's a good collection of infielders.